Hello everyone, we all know that our four-legged friends are valued not just for their external qualities, physique, or malleable character. A true friend is a devoted companion who will support you in grief, protect you in case of danger, and sincerely share joy. As you can see, dogs fit this description perfectly, so people call them best friends for a reason. Today, we will talk about different breeds, as well as about the peculiarities of their character and behavior. Brazilian Fila, Fila Brasileiro, and Brazilian Mastiff. They have a lot of options to call this dog. In ancient times, these animals were often used by plantation owners, colonists, to scare off large predators like jaguars. They also used them for hunting large animals. And this is obvious because despite their huge size and weight, these dogs are very flexible and mobile. Another interesting fact is that the Brazilian fila can follow the owner on a horse for quite a long time and reach speeds of up to 55 kilometers per hour. Bravery, determination, and boundless devotion to the owner are the main features of the representatives of this breed. At the same time, this dog does not like strangers and is unlikely to allow outsiders to take anything with them, especially if they appear on their territory. The Risen Schnauzer is a truly versatile working dog breed. They're smart, obedient, and learn new things very quickly. That's why the representatives of this breed are loved by the police and rescue workers. As for having a giant schnauzer as a pet, it is better to carefully weigh all the pros and cons. And all because these dogs are suitable exclusively for active owners with strong character. At the same time, their appearance is unusual. They are huge, have a beard, a mustache, and thick eyebrows, which give them an impressive appearance. The Russian Greyhound got into the global rating of the most beautiful dogs back in the early 19th century. Elegant appearance and unique hunting qualities made this dog a real favorite of many aristocrats and members of royal families. In a way, the breed can be called specific. Greyhounds are quite friendly animals, but you still shouldn't expect any bright feelings and a splash of emotions from them. These dogs keep their distance not only from strangers, but also from family members, showing affection only to their owners. In addition, it is necessary to approach the issue of its training extremely delicately, since greyhounds are very painful to insults and insults. They also need long runs and regular trips out of town. Shih Tzu is one of the most ancient breeds. It is not known for certain when it appeared, but there is evidence that such dogs lived in Tibet even before our era. Shih Tzu is often called a lion dog, and you don't have to look surprised now. After all, its small size and bright luxurious appearance are not there for decoration. On the contrary, this dog will be a brave, courageous, but at the same time calm and loyal companion for you. By the way, standing up for itself and bravely rushing to the defense of the owner is a matter of honor for this dog. In other cases, it cannot be called angry or aggressive. If you want to have an inquisitive, alert, and energetic four-legged friend, then the Pyrenean Shepherd dog will be an excellent choice. These are the real Einsteins in the dog world. They are active, quick to learn, and so durable that they can even tire even the most athletic owner. It is necessary to regularly conduct various types of training with rewards as well as all kinds of games and dog sports. So by having such a mobile companion, you will always stay in good shape too. By the way, the Pyrenean Shepherd has a strong shepherd instinct which should also be used in the right direction. Representatives of this breed have been acting as herding dogs for a long time. They are perfectly adapted to harsh climactic conditions and have an independent character. The main decoration of Bernese Mountain Dog is definitely their stunning fur, which makes them look like aristocrats. 
But despite their large size, dogs are still not devoid of elegance. Another feature of them is that Bernese Mountain Dogs find it very difficult to bear separation from their owner. And dogs, which have been abandoned, often cannot cope without psychological support. Lancier is a large and strong dog, and we will talk about them now. They are reliable companions, especially for families with young children. These dogs with unusually attractive appearance and self-esteem are good-natured, calm, sociable, friendly, and loyal. One needs to know about their unpretentiousness and excellent health. However, it is worth remembering that Lanciers still have quite large dimensions. That is why they are not suitable for keeping in an apartment. And to maintain good health, dogs need physical activity and long walks. Pakistani Mastiff or Bully Cutta is a truly strong animal in all aspects. I want to highlight the most important fact. If you have a soft, timid character, or you have a subconscious fear of a big dog and you will not be able to dominate it, then do not even consider this breed. Bully Cutta's temper is quite stubborn and wayward. That is why they need a firm hand and skillful guidance from the owner. If you're able to take control into your own hands in your relationship, the dog will be infinitely devoted to you and will become the most loyal and loving friend in the world. Animals have a fairly high level of aggression towards strangers, so intruders are unlikely to cause your family any problems. They will even regret their decision very quickly, of course, since you have such a defender. The Alaskan Malamute is considered one of the most ancient breeds that have long lived near humans. It is a pretty big dog, I'd even say a real giant. However, its character is very kind, affectionate, and completely non-aggressive. Some people may even confuse Alaskan Malamutes with Huskies. They really have similarities in their appearance, but the first ones are more independent. Dogs are incredibly fond of people and are attached to their owners, but they have a special love for children. And finally, if you need a reliable watchdog, then the Malamute is definitely not suitable for this role. Many people call this dog the Anatolian Shepherd, but Turkish breeders do not accept it. Kangals, as they are actually called in their homeland, are valued and revered in Turkey, so they are not allowed to leave the country. At the same time, Kangal is a very independent dog that needs a brave and strong-willed owner. These pets are considered first-class guards with excellent innate qualities. In addition, they have a strong sense of territory, so these dogs will do everything for the protection of the farms entrusted to them. The most important thing is that the owners are forbidden to use harsh methods and rudeness during the training of the pet. This shall be done not to cause excessive anger in Kangles.